Thanks for stopping by Rusty Nuts Garage. This morning I ordered 40 bare root strawberry plants and now I need a place to put them. So I will take a plastic barrel that I've already got and turn it into a planter. Please enjoy. I've looked over the barrel and decided that I'm gonna use 33 as the height of the barrel. So I'll put it in three di different grids, 11, 22, and then 33. Split them in half, so I'll be at five and a half, 16 and a half, and then 27 and a half. I'm gonna put eight slits around. I don't have a cloth measuring tape, so I'm gonna use a ratchet strap as my measuring tape. And then I'm gonna use this seam. There's one on each side, but I'm gonna use one of the seams so that way I get nice, straight, evenly spaced pockets. I'm also gonna use these wine bottles, which I picked up at the recycling center, as the pockets. I'm gonna leave the lid on until the very end. That way the, the whole barrel will be more stable, I think. So here we go. few things that I wanted to tell you about on this barrel that way you'll know and maybe it'll help you if you're gonna build one number one I started out with three and a half inch slits in here but found that five inches was the best the other thing I found out too was that this barrel is thicker on one side by quite a bit than the other side so the heat that I had to put on it was different on one side than it was the other so I couldn't really say oh 15 seconds or 20 seconds did it um, the other thing I did find out was I used medium heat. I didn't try to heat it too much because the first time I heated too much, it just, it, it was almost like it seared it. The inside wasn't hot, but the outside was melting. So a medium heat worked the best. Another thing is make sure you wear gloves if you're gonna do it because I wore a welding glove, but I had a glass break on me. That could have been a bad thing, but everything worked out okay, but I'm glad I was wearing my glove and naturally wear your safety glasses. In my next video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to complete this. I'll put in the, uh, the potting soil, strawberries, a drip irrigation system. I'll also put rock in the bottom for drainage and everything. And I uh, hope you'll watch it. I appreciate you watching the video here. And uh, please subscribe if you will. Thank you.